Hey everyone, it's me, Taki Ray, and yes, it's been a while since I posted a proper video on this channel. And that's because, yo, this year has been super busy for me with work and other side projects. Um, for those that don't know, I work as a technology lawyer, and these days I've been getting really deep into AI. Um, I've been going to events, meetups, and also creating AI content on my other channels. And I'm doing all of this because I really believe in the future of AI. And in fact, this year, I built my first ever mobile app. And you bet it has AI in it. So actually, let me show you. So my app is called Sync Trainer and it's available on both iOS and Android. And basically, it's an app that can analyze and grade your dance. And it can tell you how synchronized the dance was how difficult the moves were and how many formation changes took place in your dance performance and it returns all these results in objective statistics so that you have a very objective measure of your performance in addition the app can also pinpoint the frame or the point in your performance where the synchronization wasn't the best so that you can improve your dance and make it more clean and this is highly useful for any dance instructors or basically any dance crew that needs to improve their performance. And you can use this app to analyze K-pop dancers, gymnastics routine, martial arts choreography, or basically any type of group synchronized activity, you can use this app. Now for those who have been following my channel, yes, this is the mobile phone version of the AI software that I built to analyze K-pop dancers on this channel. And this app is completely free to install and use. And the reason why I made this was because over the past few years, I received so many kind words and requests from you to ask me to analyze your favorite K-pop dancers. Obviously, I didn't have the time to action everyone's request. Hence why I built this app so that anyone in the world can use this app to analyze their favorite K-pop dancers. You can find more information about my app in my app trailer, which I'm playing right now. I'll um, link in the description below. Um, but yeah, actually, let me just show you how to use the app. And while I'm at it, might as well analyze some K-pop dance practices of 2022. Let's go. Um, normally you use the app to analyze your own dance, but because we're analyzing K-pop dancers, we're just going to screen record um, K-pop dance practices. And basically, you just need to find any video that has a group of people dancing the same moves. And basically, I like to analyze the chorus because that's where they normally dance the same moves together. Uh, just get out your phone and just record them dancing. So let's go. This is hot. This is hot. And after that, you just whip out the app, go to upload video, find the video you just recorded, so here, and just let the app do its thing. It takes around a few seconds to analyze. And done. Once the app has finished analyzing, it will show you the statistics. And the Seraphim in the Anti Fragile Dance scored 90.45% dance synchronization that is awesome so 90% above is really good and let's just see where they could have improved on the synchronization let's say this one as you can see here the members were meant to put their right arm on their left arm but here I think Unche kind of missed the angle right there and yeah and also there's more information when you tap on the icon right there and yeah, that's about it. Um, very useful for any dancers out there. Oh yeah, just a disclaimer, the results produced by my app are only meant to be rough estimates. They're not meant to be, you know, 100% perfect and accurate. Um, they're only there just to guide you, just to give you a, a sense of to how well you performed. And I guess for the rest of this video, I'll just analyze a couple more dance practices and react to their results. And if I don't cover any of your favorite dance practices today, um, just download the app and try it out for yourself. So yeah, let's go. Let's go, first one. Where can I get some new jeans? Because I just ripped my jeans. <laughs> Catchiest chorus out of the year. Attention. 
All right, what do they get? 77.14%. Mm, that's very interesting. It's probably because this dance has a lot of slow, drawn out poses. And probably the angles are not as clean in those slow, drawn out phases, which is totally stylistic. So I guess that's probably why the score wasn't as high as 90. Still really good, man. Yes, here we go. You can't do a K-pop video without BTS. Yo, this one, they went hard. They went super hard on this dance, and it's really... I love them, man. I love them. 82.57% for this. Woo! That is a good score, considering how intense this dance was. So, mad respect. Mad respect. 17. Yo, it's the golden rule that... You cannot do a K-pop synchronization video without mentioning these dudes 17. Like, look at them go, wow. Ooh, okay, this time they only got 81.86%. Hmm, normally 17 in my other videos get 90%, but I think 80% makes sense here because you have these sort of free flow movements where it's less synchronized, but that's, com again, completely stylistic. Yeah, yeah. Again, it's very hip-hop-y, so synchronization is probably not the main focus in this choreography. Well, normally, 17 is super synchronized, so I'm pretty satisfied with that result. This is this is a very satisfying move. I don't know why. The, this, the crane thingy. It sounds very, like, great Gatsby. Um, just high class, just high class. Mm. Ooh, 81.74%. That's very interesting. Uh, I can I can see that because they have quite a few long drawn out movements where you know not everyone is at the precise and same angle. So 81% makes sense for me. Alright, end mix. Their, their songs are the type of songs where the first time you listen to it, you're like, what? But after the second and third time, be like, yeah, this is dope. And yeah, this is one of the songs that I just didn't like at first. But after a while, I was like, hmm, this is good. This is good. What? 91.34%. That's, that's good. That is good. Okay, that's clean. That is clean. And yeah, I think this song had many straight angles. Like, straight angles, straight angles, straight angles. Yeah, it's great. Yeah, okay. And mix, very good dances. And yeah, well, that's about it for this video. Only wanted to experiment with a few K-pop groups, but didn't cover your favorite group or dance practice. Just install the app and try it out yourself. Um, yeah, thanks for watching. Thanks for being patient while I was away. And yeah, hope to see you soon in my next videos. Let's go. Take care. Basically, this negative correlation. <laughs> the most optimal configuration video for you, and it shows you your synchronizations. The statistics in the middle, and I added a dark theme to my app. And we upload video, and also just zoom in, zoom out. Pretty much done. Also, I have given my app a new name to change the language setting of the app. Good. A boy has just released his first Bobo Up Sync Trainer. Yeah.